Hi, I'm Jacob Portman. You've probably never heard of me before, but my story could benefit you and the people you love. Fairy tales. We've all heard or read a fairy tale at least once in our lives. My favorite fairy tales being the ones my grandfather told me when I was a kid. These fairy tales were full of abnormal kids with unique abilities like levitation, super strength, and even invisibility. I was fascinated by these stories and believed in them with all my heart. But once I grew up, my belief in these stories faded away. My common sense told me they were fake, but deep inside me, I had a spark telling me I needed to explore them. One night when I was 15, I found my grandfather dead in the woods. I saw a creature that night, but no one believed me, not even my friend who was there to witness it. After my grandfather's death, I was stuck. I had horrible nightmares and needed constant therapy. I hid from life and let the world pass me by. Fortunately, my father came up with a brilliant idea. We would go on a trip to the island my grandfather used to live when he was a kid. He said it would be great for father-son bonding. And for the first time in a while, I was excited. Excited to explore and learn. Once my grandfather passed away, I lost trust in family and friends. I especially lost trust in my father, who did not trust my grandfather. After meeting a group of children on the island, I began to learn that trust is a mandatory trait everyone should have. In addition to trust, everyone should have qualities of leadership to make others trust them. Without leadership skills, no one can rely on you to complete a task, or in my case, protect my friends. That's what I do. I can see the monsters. Lurking in the shadows, the monsters feed off of our peculiar abilities. Without me, every one of the kids in the children's home would be dead. They need to be able to trust me, and I need to be able to earn their trust with my leadership. At home, we all have family and friends that we have lost trust in. Once this presentation is over, I would like you to reach out to those who have lost your trust and begin building an unbreakable relationship. This will take time, weeks to months to even years. One day, that person could be the only family member you have left, and having a connection with them will benefit both of you. In my opinion, trust is the most valuable connection someone can have with their loved ones. Having the ability to tell that you can have trust in someone is the base in a strong relationship. From potential death or making the dinner in time, trust will build a relationship that will be held forever. Thank you for your time, and I hope you earn the trust of the loved ones surrounding you.